Oh, hello, Leo. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support, and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment. This reading resonates. Let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity. What messages do you have for a sign of Leo? Please and thank you. What messages do you have for a sign of Leo? So this is some sort of spiritual message for you guys. Um, I, this is so odd because forgiveness popping up here in the future. They're wanting you to release something. This is more dealing with some of some of you guys. This is like a family situation, but this is like dealing with some people that you try to help in one way or the other. You try to help these people, but I'm getting like these people trying to let me make sure is it shaking? Yeah, it is. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm getting like these people trying to like program your way of thinking about yourself, like to make you think like you're not capable of doing certain things here. <coughs> like they really try to program you basically. And it was ultimately to get you to miss out on your purpose in life. You're, it's not coming from, I'm getting like these people will definitely be asking for your forgiveness. I keep shaking this, don't know. This is exactly, this, this is why I started doing the videos where it was facing me, but I'm so tired of having to worry about, you know, dressing, trying to look, I, I just don't want to be on the camera. I want to just focus on the cars. That's the reason why. So I'm sorry, this thing keeps shaking. It's all against the table. <coughs> Let me just <coughs> try not to shake it. Somebody definitely doesn't want you to uh, get this message. But I'm definitely getting here that they're wanting you to just release this. Some of you guys like really releasing these people and separating yourself from them. Because some of you guys... Some of y'all haven't really uh, forgiven them, and that's the ultimate. That's the ultimate release here for you to find. Yeah, because they <clears throat> really try right there. That's the ultimate release right here.
I'm gonna tell you guys what, somebody don't want you to get a message here. They do not want you guys to get a message at all. So you guys, what I have never had like a reaction like this before. I don't, you know, like I'm really getting like someone does not <clears throat> want someone here to get a message. And it's like so significant <clears throat> to someone here. So I'm going to tell you what the Ace of Wands once in the upright, it talks about feeling inspired, uh, feeling like taking action towards a new beginning here. But here in the recent past, I'm getting some of y'all like you didn't quite understand why there was this like you felt drained like <clears throat> you were uninspired like you didn't have it within you to take action towards a new direction here and really it was because you were going towards because you're leading towards the hierophant energy here which talks about spiritual growth it talks about someone who's enlightened someone who people goes to for guidance because what was what what whatever you were dealing with that was causing you to feel uninspired that was triggering you not to take action here this is going to be released this energy is being released off of you because there's some justice being served i'm really getting because with the chariot in reverse you're going to see something here. Because it's like someone wants to stop you from reaching a certain level of spiritual growth here. But you're going to reach it regardless. Like they want to keep you from reaching the top of the mountain. But instead of <clears throat> stopping you. It's like they're having something thrown in their way. Like the universe is throwing something along their path. Some of y'all, it's another person that they're going to be fighting with. Doing the same things to them that they were doing to you. But they're not going to be able to handle the load that they were throwing at you. Because with the chariot in reverse. The chariot in reverse talks about trusting someone to take control over a peer, uh, like a, a particular area in your life. This is someone that you could have trusted and then you realize like things were out of control when you allowed this person to take control. Some of you guys, whether it was a parent, it was a sibling, family, or someone you consider like a best friend, but... <clears throat> This was all just the universe's way of letting you know that you were more than capable of doing something on your own. You didn't need anyone to do something for you. You didn't need this person to do something in particular for you. So this was all just a lesson for you to learn. But at the same point, the, the same person that was trying to do all this, they were just doing too much here, trying to stop you from, from reaching some certain level a spiritual growth and it's because you're meant to be some sort of like spiritual advisor here like you're supposed to help guide people along their path whatever way you're doing it it doesn't mean you guys are doing tarot cards you guys could be doing you could write books you could um whatever whatever profess profession you're in you're utilizing your spiritual gift to help bring wisdom and growth to others 
And then the same people here that were trying to prevent you from achieving this level in your life, the same load that they were trying to make you carry, they're not going to be able to carry themselves. And that's justice being served. <coughs> Like whenever I blew my nose, that thing is loud. Honey, that's why I was like, ever lost that sea? All I need is this nose. <clears throat> Let's see what's going on because y'all obviously have <clears throat> something here that's of significance. Someone has an important message here. I have never had, and I'm like pushing through this. <clears throat> Lighthouse, control your anger or you will be sorry. Spare heartache over what you no longer have. Butterfly, a change for the better. Some people here, <clears throat> this was a lesson for some people. This is the lesson that they're learning because you have some people that were envious of you. I'm not getting like just a typical type of jealousy energy. I'm getting some people that saw the light within you and they wanted to take that from you. And now they're like they pierced their own heart because you guys have removed yourself from out of their life. And you, in the process of removing yourself from some individuals' lives here, your life has changed for the better. They're realizing what it's like to no longer have you in their presence. That you were the blessing in their life. <clears throat> And you know what? They were given like they were given messages here. They were given warnings time and time again to chill out, to stop whatever they were doing. But they didn't take heed to the message that they were receiving. They continued to press it. They wanted to continue to see how far they could push it, to push their luck here. Only for the universe to finally say, enough is enough. It's time for them to learn their lesson. <clears throat> Some of you guys, so there's something significant in January. <clears throat> I'm saying Pinocchio, so I'm saying like a lie being exposed here and stopped right in this track with it being frozen here. Yeah, <clears throat> because this is some sort of force that's working against you, but it's going to be stopped right, uh, right in the midst of this track. And it looks like the person that's stopping it is like a friend here or someone that is giving you like someone that you'll view in like a friendly manner here. Someone that's giving you some advice or that's guiding you. I'm getting like this person is stopping whoever it is. They may be someone else's friend. Like, hey, stop, you know, giving this person advice to just cut out whatever they're doing here. It could be a woman that you guys are dealing with. They could have dark hair, <clears throat> dark eyes. Or this is you <clears throat> and you have some sort of exciting event coming about here.
They're saying that you guys will be in some sort of position of authority. Some of y'all may be partnering up with another female here. <clears throat> I'm seeing like some female here. Uh, what I'm really seeing is someone here <clears throat> like you're not where you want to be. And there is another woman that's in a position of power, a position of authority. She's in a higher position than you. And this person is observing you. They're watching you. You're not, you don't see this person watching you, but they're going to play a significant role in your life. They're going to bring some sort of major opportunity your way because they like whatever you're doing. They like your work, your work ethics. They come across as being like kind of cold, but this person has a really good heart. They're also, the, it's like the reason why they, they come across the way they do is they like to keep their uh, profession, their professional relationships separate from their personal relationships. And that's because if, if anything was to ever go down, they want to make sure that they can always do the right thing and that they won't feel um, persuaded to go against what they feel is right because they consider someone a friend. So when they're in the work setting, they always come across as being like a kind of cold and distant individual. But that's because this is the type of individual that always wants to do the right thing. And they're observing you and there's something that they really like about you. They take an interest in you. Beware of some sort of self-delusion here. <clears throat> Let's see what this is. In August. Some of you guys, if you know your Chinese horoscope, y'all may be the year of the dragon. <clears throat> Pineapple, reconciliation. Someone is trying to come between you and a friend or something you want. So <clears throat> beware of self-delusion. I'm getting because with here with August, I'm seeing like the moon as well and reconciliation. So it looks like someone wants a reconciliation with you or you want a reconciliation with someone else here. There is some sort of fire breathing dragon here present in this situation. And I'm not getting that it's you or your person. So there's someone that is spreading some sort of lies. They're coming in between you and this person and causing some sort of illusion, which is the reason why you have the moon in between this reconciliation between you and this person. They're causing this wedge between you and this person. Whoever this dragon is that's spreading these lies, they're causing all this fire. <clears throat> so I'm getting you and this person don't even quite understand why is there even distance between the two of you? Why is there even some sort of hostility? You guys don't even understand what is really going on, but it's because there's been some sort of lies being spread by whoever this dragon energy is. <clears throat> okay. Just want to get a couple more Oracle cards for you guys, and we will close this one out. <clears throat> Your vibration is rising. All is in perfect timing. So you guys have some major doors opening up for you. And it's all happening in perfect timing. That's what you guys need to 
I'm getting that you guys are already aware of it happening in perfect timing, but you need to realize when it's not happening when you want, it's going to happen exactly when you need it to. You guys are needing to have more control over your thoughts in order to embrace your life purpose because there's some of you guys can get caught in like this negative mindset um, and it's because you want something here and now or you get distracted. They're wanting you to remain focused and to stay in control. Don't allow anyone to place any fears or doubts within your head. You guys were meant to walk in power. You were meant to walk in love. You weren't meant to walk in fear. Whatever you are dealing with is almost over because you guys are about to step into something, some sort of major opportunity here. Your vibration is rising. Some of you guys are noticing like your intuition increasing. <clears throat> you definitely like... I, this is so... I, I haven't had it like... And I'm telling you guys, I've had where it was like trying to do your message and it's just like blocked. <clears throat> so it's definitely some sort of blockage. I'm not getting with you, but definitely some people not wanting you to reach some, like your your destiny here. They're wanting to block it. And they're trying their hardest to prevent you from reaching it. But it's not going to work. And the thing is, is that whatever they're trying to, trying to throw at you, they're not going to be able to they're not going to be able to carry it them them their damn selves here but that's just their karma because they need to see the same thing that they were trying to make you deal with it's going to be too much for them to bear it's like as soon as you guys decide to no longer carry this load it's going right back on them because it's balancing back out so I'm going to leave it there. These are the messages that came through for you guys at this time. Be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, you all take care.